Well, 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 well. Look who it is. If it isn't Princess finally doing what she's told. I'm glad that the fever finally came down. And I am glad that you finally came to your senses. How are you feeling today? I'm happy to hear that. I have to say, for someone who spent so long talking about how you would never work, how you would never do anything for me, you do look mighty cute in that maid outfit. Maybe I should make you wear this maid outfit all the time. Hmm, maybe I should make you my personal maid. Anyway. <sighs> See? Was it so hard to just go with the flow and work a little? Look how good you're doing now. You're working off your debt. You're not sleeping outside. And you're just living a comfortable life. You know, there's not many jobs out there anymore. So, not a bad deal. Like I said, I'm no monster. You know me. We're friends, right? Right? Of course we are friends. Of course we're friends. If we weren't, why would I let you work here? Why would I take care of you? So well, too. I mean, letting you sleep in my house, giving you a room, that's a lot. But we're friends, right? That's what friends do. And I offer you all of this in exchange for you putting on your cute little maid outfits and cleaning the house for a few hours a day. Well, not a few hours. It is a pretty big place. And there is not a lot of maids. But you don't mind, right? This is the same as hmm, cleaning your own house. Imagine being paid to stay in your house and just clean it. Isn't that a dream? You get to stay home all day long and do nothing? While I have to go outside and work and bring in the money. You know, it's really tiring being in the position that I am right now. But do you see me complaining? No. I get up in the morning and I go to work. Not saying that you don't work, of course. You've been doing a really good job. This place hasn't been this clean in since I've got it, actually. It's been five years. You're doing amazingly well. Who knows? Maybe if you keep working this hard, I could promote you to managing the maids. You could be a maid manager. <laughs> So they would stop being so lazy. Maybe they would be just like you if you were to manage them. Wouldn't you like that? Well, that would mean that this is no longer you paying off your debt. You would actually work for me. Hmm, maybe. Maybe that wouldn't be so bad. What do you think? Would you enjoy that? Would you enjoy staying in this mansion with me for the foreseeable future? I have to tell you this though, and this is, let's keep it between us two, okay? I knew you were something special the moment I saw you that night. I'm glad I brought you in. You know, in the car, my chauffeur told me to just leave you outside. I asked him why, and he said, she's wet. She will ruin the leather. <laughs> I've been thinking about that for a little while now, but isn't it crazy that out of all the reasons why I should or not take you in, the one and only reason he told me 
was it would ruin the leather. I mean, I could always buy a new car. Is a car really as valuable as a human life? Well, maybe not all human lives, but you, you are worth it. Well, it is what I get for being in this business. This business doesn't really care about emotions. But I've said this many times, and I might sound like a broken record, but I'm not a monster. I'm just a man running a business. Except, well, my business isn't acceptable. Let's just leave it at that for now. Anyway, I just wanted to tell you this. You did a good job. You're doing a very, very good job. And I hope you will keep doing a good job and playing ball. And I promise good things might happen to you from now on. Maybe taking that loan might have been the best decision you ever made in the end. Who knows? <sighs> You're a good girl. Hey, why don't you take tomorrow off? I have something I want to show you. Now, this is going to be a special event and sadly, you cannot wear your maid uniform, no matter how adorable you look in it. Don't worry about clothing. I'll take care of it. I'll get you something that you will look amazing in. My butler will get you something nice to wear. Can't tell you why. That's, <laughs> that's a secret, for now at least. I'll see you tomorrow, princess. Keep doing a wonderful job, and we will see eye to eye, okay? Glad we understand each other. <laughs> see you tomorrow. Princess. Hello everyone, this is Kupip, not Mafia Boyfriend. Just here to say that I now have a Discord server which you can join using the link down below. Thank you for watching.